Hello, I'm Alan Levine, and I'm copying Dean Chiresky. <laughs> I do that a lot. He copies me a little bit, but I've really been impressed, Dean, with what you're doing in your guitar lessons as a, as a model project for your students. I think there's a real power to the fact that you as the teacher are doing the same assignment that your students are doing, and that's something that I've always admired about people like uh, Jim Groom and Barbara Ganley. So you're going to try to spend 100 hours learning to do, play guitar, and you've been picking it up. You're strumming and you're getting along. But the whole thing about doing it in this video form, uh, blogging about it, uh, being in public, uh, just says a lot as a model for informal learning, something I strongly believe in and, and has a lot of value. So I just can't let that slide by and not try to do something. So um, in, in my road travels, I've been, been thinking about you know what it might be. Um, you know, I, I could always learn to play guitar better, but, you know, I already know my chords, uh, at least some of them, at least three of them. Um, so, but I have the ideal thing, something I've been wanting to learn, and I thought I would take the time to do it on my road trip, and I haven't. So, um, I really want to know um, how to play uh, this blues harmonica, or any harmonica. So, uh, I got it for the trip. Originally, I wasn't even going to bring my guitar. I was just going to bring this because this is this is ideal. I mean, this little thing uh, in the hands of someone who knows what they're doing can play music. And it's so small. It can go wherever you go. You can take it camping. You can take it, you know, on the plane, et cetera. And, you know, just pull out the harmonica and go, wah, 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 and all that stuff. And people who are good, you know, they make it look so easy. So I've had this thing in my backpack. It's been in my truck. I haven't done anything with it. One night I did look at some videos, and of course there are tons of videos to teach you how to play. Um, so I'm going to take it as my goal, Dean, to uh, try to catch up with you and learn how to play uh, blues harmonica and eventually hopefully be able to play uh, with my guitar. So I know um, <laughs> I know almost nothing about it, but I know from the videos, especially for the blues harmonica, I did get... I had an old one, uh, but I actually bought the wrong key. So the whole thing is getting the right key. So, you know, I like to play guitar in the key E, you know, E, A, D, E, A, B, etc. So to get the right kind of harmonica for that, you have to get um, the, the A. So you have to go E, F, G, A. Hope I got the right one. Well, it's the fifth or the fourth. What the heck? Yeah. So, yeah. So the A harmonica goes with playing uh, guitar chords in E. So, you know, I have this. And I did watch a couple videos, and pretty much what I heard was that all the action <laughs> takes place really mostly, if I can point right in the reverse camera, on the first three holes. And you know, it's it's in and out. So, but I haven't tried anything. I just watched the video and said, well, if I you know came back to this one day, I might learn. So, you know, I know there's and there's you know that's just blowing in, and so but you know in and out make a difference. I'm just making noise right now. So, this is just my intro. I'm making noise right now. I'm going to try to watch the videos, uh, try to get some lessons. I'm looking for tips too. So, that's part of the whole process is people are giving you tips. And I know there's tons of you know places to go get your harmonica lessons. And you know, I've already heard from you know my buddy Brian Jackson, and he's already told me you know, I, when I get the neck holder so I can play it with the, you know, the Bob Dylan style when I'm playing the guitar. So, um, I'll get around to that. But you know, first, I just need to get some of the, the basic mechanics. And uh, you know, I'm hoping it's not that hard. And you get better at stuff just by doing it again and again and again. You don't get better at stuff by quitting. You don't get better at stuff by trying it and putting it down. You get better at stuff about making a commitment and uh, trying to do it. So, uh, Dean, I'm doing blues harmonica. I'm way behind you, but look out, man. I'm catching up. I'll be well and pretty soon, I hope. See you around.